Yo, what's going on, YouTube? If you clicked on this video, I'm guessing you're in need of a Demigod Center build. And today, I got you with just that. I don't want to waste too much of y'all time, but before we get into this, all I ask is that you guys like and subscribe. Also, please watch the entire video because I'm getting super close to getting partnered. And if you guys do end up liking this video or this build, please make sure to leave me a comment. I like to read all my comments and reply to almost every single one. But without any further ado, let's hop right into the builder and show y'all how to make this build. All right, and now that we're in the builder the first thing you want to do is set the position to the power forward position i know the video says it is a center build but trust me you get way better attributes and way better everything at the power forward position so it's just the smarter thing to do now like i say in every single one of my videos handedness and jersey number do not matter so i always go with right handed on my big man builds and then my number is always 99 but you can go with literally anything that you want now for our body settings we're actually going to go six foot ten a lot of the most common builds on this game are six foot nine so you already have an advantage there and you can go higher on this height but if you do that it might bring a lot of the attributes down and i just think that six foot ten is the perfect height for this build now for your weight you're going to want to go with 223 pounds it seems like it's going to be a small big man build but trust me you will be fine you still do get it up to an 82 strength so you get silver bully and you will be able to lock up people in the paint so don't worry about any of that now our wingspan is going to be seven foot seven this way you still get a really good three-point shot you still get that 82 strength for silver bully you get a great driving dunk great finishing stats and amazing defensive stats as well and you can go with any body shape in my opinion i think solid looks the best but if you want to look like a bigger type big man build then you could definitely go with the finder built I'm gonna go with solid but that's up to you now the first thing we're gonna upgrade is our driving dunk and that's actually the only thing we're gonna upgrade in our finishing however when we upgrade it it brings up our finishing attributes as well you can tweak this build to however you want to get maybe more standing dunk or stuff like that but i've found that this is absolutely perfect for kind of a pick and pop and pick and roll type of build so you don't have to worry about any of that once you upgrade the driving dunk to a 93 you get elite contacts with gold posterizer badge as well so you'll be perfectly fine with all of that and also do not worry about the 11 badge count and finishing i tested it out 11 works out perfectly you get every single badge you need now for our shooting all we're gonna do is max out our three-point shot you end up getting 15 shooting badges if you are on current gen that is the perfect amount especially for a big man you don't have to worry about you know like the tier threes and stuff but if you're on next gen and you make this build exactly how i do you should get more badges in that category you shouldn't only get 15 so don't worry you'll be perfectly fine you can tweak this a bit so you get a higher mid-range but i actually found that i don't shoot a lot of mid-ranges so i don't need it but if you find that you do you could definitely upgrade that next thing we're gonna upgrade is our pass accuracy we're gonna upgrade this to a 75 that way if you're on next gen you get the lebron pass style and if you are on current gen your passes are still just as fast as they need to be and they won't be super slow now for now we're gonna skip over the defensive rebounding category and just move right on to the physicals but we will obviously go back to defense we're gonna max out our speed that way we're as fast as possible uh then we're also gonna max out our acceleration that way we're on, when we're running down the court and we, or when we first start running we're fast as possible as well and then our strength we're gonna max that out so we do get the 82 i made this exactly so you get an 82 strength so you can just max that out right away and then our vertical this is super important you want to go up to at least an 82 vertical you can go higher but there isn't really too much of a point unless you want it for defense or something like that but with an 82 vertical you get all of the contact dunks in the game this year even if you do have a high driving dunk you also need to upgrade your vertical that way you can actually unlock the contact dunk packages and finally we're just going to upgrade our stamina up to a 92 that way we still you know it's still pretty high and once you have gym rat it'll actually be a 96 so you'll be fine now for our defense the first thing we're gonna do is upgrade our interior defense to a 90 we'll be getting all the stops you'll be able to stop post scores you'll be able to stop rim runners all of that do not worry 90 is plenty you don't have to max it out this will be plenty and then our perimeter defense a huge plus on this bill we're gonna max that out to an 81 that way you get all the stops on any of the guards in case you need to switch or anything like that so you'll be able to stop anyone on this build and then for our steel we're gonna upgrade that to a 78 this gives us silver interceptor and we also get bronze glove steels are super overpowered on this game so you don't even need it that high but it is good to have it 
So if you get silver interceptor on, you'll be given all the lanes and all, everything you need there. The next thing we're going to upgrade is our block. We're going to upgrade this to a 93. Blocks aren't that common in this game, but if you do have it high enough and you do have the right badges on, you can get a ton of blocks and get a bunch of stops. So with the 93 block, you do get gold anchor as well as chase down artist hall of fame. That's going to be a huge game changer. I have a hall of fame chase down on my six foot 10 iso build and it is already crazy enough but with the addition of gold anchor you're going to be getting every single stop on any rim runner and then we're going to move right on to our defensive rebound we're going to upgrade that to a 97 and just max it out 97 rebound you'll be getting every single board and then also we're going to upgrade our offensive rebound up to an 80 and that is going to max out our build you'll be getting all the stops and then you'll also get the board to go along with it to secure the stop and get the ball back you'll be getting you, you can get assist easily on this build you could shoot easily and you'll be finishing in the paint on anybody but like i said if you guys do want to tweak this build just a little bit you most definitely can but you do want to keep the main things that i talk about the same but there are some attributes you could definitely bring down if in case you want to bring something else up but our final badge count is 11 15 8 and 28 like i said you'll be getting all the stops and your offense just perfectly matches it you'll be able to do everything on the court now for our primary takeover i definitely recommend spot up shooter that way you don't miss any shots once you have takeover and once you get it equipped and as we know spot up shooter has been one of the best takeovers in any year of 2k to use you definitely want to have that on since you're going to be spotting up or pick and popping on all of that and then after that you can actually choose between rim take and glass take in my opinion rim take is the better one especially once you have two takeovers on one build so what i'm gonna do is go with rim take but you most definitely can go with glass take in case you want to be snagging over anybody and get a bunch of rebounds and there we have it the two-way inside out score with shades of aaron gordon and jaron jackson jr this is going to be a crazy build and i hope you guys really enjoy this in case you do make it and if you do definitely let me know if you like it in the comments all right so i hopped in the one score just so i can show you guys how this build plays it's going to be kind of difficult since i am a big man on the one score with no guard but i'm gonna try my best i'm gonna show you guys how this build can finish how this build can play defense and hopefully how this build can shoot as long as this guy doesn't play me too high green bean never mind i lied to you okay all right all right let's see hey okay let's go all right all right let's go man all right let me let me just keep showing y'all how this build plays one of my favorite moves is a little post up and then just a post spin it gets people every single time so let's see if we can do that real quick do that real quick okay that was kind of a slow one, but it worked. Let's go. Come on, man. I told y'all the post spin gets him every single time. Let's go. Come on. All right, he left me open. Bean bean, let's go, man. I'm telling y'all, this bill can shoot. I started off a bit rusty because it was my first game. I'm not gonna lie, this bill can shoot. Okay. Left me open. Green. Let's go. Come on, man. All right. Where's he at? okay little flashy dunk come on man let's go all right let's try that kevin durant hop jumper again I, what, what that that was most definitely not it that was most definitely not a kevin durant hop jumper i don't know what that was but all right let's try let's try it one more time green bean green for game nah this ha like i'm telling y'all man this is the best big man build in the game. If you're a big man that can do all this, just imagine when you're on the twos or threes court, running the big, setting, you're setting screens, picking, popping, picking, rolling, all of that. This is the best build in the game. I didn't even get to show off that many contact dunks, but this build gets so many contact dunks, it's unfair. If y'all did enjoy this video, please make sure to like and subscribe. We're on the grind to 10,000 subscribers. Also, I want everyone right now to comment one video idea they want to see from me, and I will try my best to get to everyone. If you enjoyed, please consider checking out some of my other videos, as well as checking out the socials I have linked all in my description. But anyways, y'all, I appreciate you guys for watching. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day, and I'll see y'all in the next video.